So I don't see any body language markers in here, her facial expression that were changing when she said that. Because so everybody's so playing their shit, I can't hear anything. Rehearse, and she actually yeah, believed that that happened, but she's still in the same gloomy and, and, and defeated body language. Reality that America actually, I think it's just faster mom. than any wealthy nation around the world. But you are right. Prices, in particular for groceries, are still too high. The American. So there was three percent inflation, which is a bit uh, over the two percent that is considered healthy inflation, but still prices are too high. H how do you combine both things? In this case, you're trying to soften the real statement, the statement of reality that prices are too high. It's, it, that is an undeniable fact. But she began to say that, well, she, uh, they inherited this uh, bad economy from Donald Trump. That is something that every single politician is going to say, so I'm just going to ignore it. That is, that's normal politics fear. And, uh, but the way that she talks about what she did, she did, that she and Biden did, is not a proud, not being proud of what she did. And this, which is something odd, because this is the kind of moment that you have the opportunity to be uh, yeah, hopeful. And she's talking about the middle class, the American middle class, to be hopeful about the future, whatever they're going to do, they're going to build. She doesn't project joy or being hopeful about anything. American people know it, I know it, which is why my agenda includes what we need to do to bring down the price of groceries. For example, dealing with an issue like price gouging, what we need to do to extend the child tax credit to help young families be able to take care of their children. Wayne Dixie inside today. What we need to do to bring down the cost of housing. How do we Dixie today? To accelerate this, uh, playing at a uh, double speed, I'm going to begin play, uh, playing at double speed. It just after pointing out that she still has this uh, pressing of the lips every now and then, uh, she still has this not confident, a bit frustrated, a bit upset, and it, it, it's not look, looking good. Again, you know that I'm not a uh, uh, Harry's or Walls fan at all. I don't, uh, I, I, I absolutely don't like the way that their policies, which by the way, they have not stated on their website yet. And we are 68. I don't want to go into politics in my stupid elections. And you. still, why would they do? Bitch. And Why would it be 25 fast cars, more expensive. Yes, it is. But 
Yes, it is, bro. Look it up. I uh, somebody once told sure me the world this. was gonna roll me. You're, you're sure that that's sharpest tool in the shed. That's the lyrics. What does that mean? That All star. What does that mean? Roll me. I don't know. Shrek sing it. But let's continue. That comes to uh, uh, the words. important question. No, let me look up all star lyrics. The steps that you're talking about now. Why she looks ugly, so that's okay. I can be ugly too. Well, first